Yo, my chair broke the last video. Look. This whole thing broke and I fell and I bust my ass. What's up y'all, it's Bricks from Bricks Fitness, the dude with the broken chair. I get asked this question a lot, right? Can I drink and still lose weight? Now here's my theory. I can't speak for anyone else but me. I like to drink every once in a while. I'm not an alcoholic, but just like anybody else, I like to go out to the bar and have a few drinks and socialize and all that jazz. I'm a true believer in balance, right? You have to have balance in your life in order for anything to be sustainable. So even people who are trying to lose weight, you still need to maintain some sort of balance. You still need to have some sort of social life or else you're gonna drive yourself crazy. Here's the thing, you can drink alcohol and lose weight, but you do have to set up some sort of guidelines. No, you can't go get wasted every weekend. That's just not how it works. Alcohol is an enemy of fat loss. I am gonna tell you that. But that's not to say that you can't still reach your fitness goals if you drink alcohol. Here's what I did. I set up guidelines. I set up some rules for myself. You have to have rules, just like with life. There has to be rules. So here are a few rules that I think that if you set up in your life, you'll be able to successfully drink alcohol once in a while, and still lose weight. Rule number one, don't overdo it. As simple as that, right? It's, it's simple and it's obvious. But here's the thing, that's hard for some people. It's, it's not easy. And if you feel like you know yourself enough to know that once you start drinking, you go overboard, then you may need to just cut alcohol out of your life until you reach your fitness goals. But if you are an adult with discipline and self-control, then you can still drink alcohol once in a while. So here, here's the rule that I set up for myself. If I have any drinks, it's either a low-calorie, low-carb beer, a straight white liquor with either club soda or just on the rocks, or a red wine, a dry red wine. I try to stay away from white wines because they're higher in sugar. So here's the thing, if you're gonna eat, you have to adhere to these rules. You have to, or else just don't drink at all. Let's say, I mean, it's different for every person. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna just tell you what I did. Two to three drinks a week, low carb, low calorie beer, vodka straight or vodka with club soda, red wine, dry red wine, and that's it. The next rule that I put in place, if ever I'm going to go out to drink, the next morning I have to get up and work out first thing in the morning. No matter what, that's the rule. If I have alcohol on the evening, the next day, the first thing in the morning, I have to work out. And while I'm in the bar, that's all I'm thinking about. Damn, I gotta get up in, in the morning and work out. Hmm, maybe I shouldn't go as hard as I may want to because I made that promise to myself, right? And my integrity as a man will not let me not stick to this promise. That's the only way this works. You have to have that commitment to yourself, right? So the rules and then the integrity to go along with following the rules and, and, and keeping your promise to yourself. That's the only way this, is work. this works. So if you're gonna go out to drink or if you're gonna have a drink or two, Make sure that you promise yourself that the next morning, the first thing in the morning, I don't care if you got to get up at 5 o'clock, you're going to work out. It's going to do one or two things, right? It's either going to make you control your drinking or it's going to make you not want to drink at all. One of the two. Either way, it's a productive thing, right? So the third rule, no greasy bar foods or no unhealthy foods, no cheat type foods in combination with alcohol. So if I'm drinking alcohol, I have to eat nothing but clean foods. So that means no pizza, no chicken wings, none of that stuff if I'm drinking alcohol. This is a rule that I set up while I was trying to lose weight that helped me adhere to my weight loss mission because when you drink your inhibitions lower right if your inhibitions are low 
you don't really care much about your weight loss mission anymore. So just try to keep that in mind. Like, also, alcohol stops the fat burning process. So whatever you're eating when you're under the influence of alcohol is going straight to your gut. Your body's not burning any of it. It's going to store as fat immediately. So just keep that in mind. You can still have a life while you're trying to lose weight. But you have to set up rules. You have to set up guidelines. And you have to stick to them. If you're not going to stick to the guidelines, then go ahead and just say, okay, I'm not going to drink at all. Because... That's the only way this is going to work. I'm trying to give you some help so that you can still enjoy life whilst trying to lose weight. I hope this video was helpful to someone. Go to BricksFitness.com. I am doing customized meal plans and I do them myself. I also have coaching slots available. Yo, shout out to my man, Steven. Steven down in Orlando, one of my online clients, he is killing it. Like when I tell you he's killing it right now, matter of fact, he did a video of one of our consultations I'm going to put the link to that video in the description. Check them out. Shout out to my man, Steven Jar. I appreciate you, bro. And as always, I'm just trying to share the wellness. So get well and get money. <laughs>